The Dark Ones came much later. From the garden's direction. The Dark Ones, huge, towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures. Creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil. That with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Just <laughs> That's all lies. <laughs> Truth is even scarier. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? What happened? Shit! Wake up, Artyom! It's me, Khan! Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's Hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base, you shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. But I still can't get used to it. <laughs> Strange place, this D6. I didn't know they ever built bunkers this large. The story is. Привет, Артём. Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, that's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. Well, anyway, uh, where were we? And did D6 save them? No. They couldn't reach it in time. And here. So for 30 years until our guys stumbled. Everything inside was untouched. Website. Come on, you have five more sets of therapy. Look at those two rookies. Pathetic. Doing no wonder the Kohler ordered training time down. Shabra, move Shabra! This charge last week, so his squad is sent to the marshes to the George base. And Romanov's the only one who makes it there alive. You're shitting me. The rest of the group, right now? Hello, Artyom. Welcome to the armory. I hear you're a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation's still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. 
Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these, but they definitely make it better for your health. Now medkits. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Here's your advance salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment for merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Haha, <laughs> alright. Now to the good stuff, huh? Let's get you some guns. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Rangers usually carry up to three weapons or two, okay, and the choice of this is completely up to you. Make sure you take a close range weapon with that one. Rifles are good for long range targets, but you don't want to get caught with your face down if something creeps up behind you. Head over to my range and try out those guns. Come back if you want to try a different gun. Here, Tom, what's on the show for me, huh? Try out, try out the rest of the weapons you chose. Target fixed! Congratulations, that was it! Complete the Try shooting for the center. Good job! Now, the defense is going to take more. Look for some more. about Lesnitsky? What are you Let talking about? Here. Check Open with the guards at the lab. Call 44. What the hell did he do? Syria, opening up! All right, let's go. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this banker. So cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Cold steel, and wild steeds, and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, killed by demons or ghosts. Or their own greed. Khan, will you shut up or what? Okay! I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows! Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone! Shit! So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The Colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have Alright, let's go. We might control these six, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, they base the order dream of finding. They say cancer is strengthening the sentry points along the whole line, especially the ones close to the Nazis.
Herman, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes, people died at exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the Order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. All right, Tarty. And you, God. You have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Order's ever faced. Colonel, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna! Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Order's job. Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom, it's your last chance for forgiveness, for getting rid of the nightmares! Ah. Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close, too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna can have a clear shot. But do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, but we haven't verified who's running him. Your job is to intercept him before he delivers the stolen container. Understood? Yes, sir. If Lesnitsky escapes with the container, the entire metro's at risk. So if you can't take... him alive. You damn well better bring me his head. Yes, sir. This is... Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. Well, we've worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. 
Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a dark one there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started. In the past, trains were ordinary things, but now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things, and their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. Alright, we've reached the station. This is part of the secret Metro 2 line. We haven't explored these tunnels. Can't spare the time or went power, so don't wander off. I'll try to put some juice on the system and get the lights on. Use your flashlights in the meantime. Right. You ready? Let's move. Watch yourself. The doors are closing. Good luck. Yeah. Didn't you and my father take the monorail when you went out to fire the missiles at the Dark One's nest? That's a good sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all. All clear. Move out. Go right. There's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed them. Stay sharp. That thing's fast. You got reflexes, I'll give you that. Great, the ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or not. Surface. Put your mask on. <sighs> Quit looking at my ass. Way out of your reach, rabbit. Give me a hand here. Let's go to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune there. What? Influence? Oh, I don't, don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck. I can see you. 
something still burning where the nest was. That's some fine wasteland. You guys sure did a good job here. It's strange. What could still be burning after all this time? Well, it doesn't matter. Move towards it. I'll cover you. I see some kind of movement. Get ready. On the right. Those aren't dark ones. They're watchmen. I'm working on them. That helm was bad luck. Get ready for more. Another three. Let's do it. The creature I met in the burnt-out remains of the gardens looks like a dark one. And it was able to enter my mind, dragging the innermost out of me. But it was also just the baby. And I am sure that it recognized me. And got scared. It also left me knocked out for some time. Just enough for me to get captured. These prisoners were captured at the botanical gardens. Seems like they were looking for something. These two are red. They refuse to speak. The third one looks like a ranger of the order. 
a mutant the size of a child, was caught near him. It was delivered to Reich as well. I'll deal with it later. This one. Suspected mutation. No, no, I'm normal. See, two arms, two legs, ten fingers. Don't you understand? I'm a Hatsa citizen. Shut up! No, <laughs> not in Hatsa. Here, you are a suspect in the distribution of corrupted genes. Hey. And this is your trial. If your skull has the correct proportions, you are free to go. If not, you are an abomination. Science, you see. This is an outrage! I told you to stay still! Well? Let's see. 318 millimeters by... Uh, 302. Let's look it up in the table. Ah, congratulations. You're a mutant. No, no, please! To the garbage shoot. A simple question. What was your mission in the garbage? Go to hell yourself, Nazi. I'm gonna count to three. One. Glory to the red line! Two. Long live Comrade Mosfin! Three. Please! Please, I'll, I'll talk. I'll talk. But, but, but away from the other side. They'll kill me if they hear. Okay? Take this one to the second unit. Usually, Reich does not interfere with the Order's business. But here, we have you, the Reds, and the Freak, all caught in the same net. I do not like it. So talk, or take a bullet to the brain. Get the officer! Hey, you! <laughs> Here. You keep the knife. You keep it. So, uh, we have with the Spartan order. I'm from the Red Line. Uh, our superiors are not on the best of terms, huh? But I say fuck that. No, oh, fuck that. The grunts stick together, huh? <laughs> the fuck? I see. Oh, you see. Remotely controlled lock. One thing's for sure. Our only chance of getting out of this alive, work together. Right. Now, what did they say about the garbage shoot? Okay. Let's get our asses out of this place. Then we'll go our separate ways. Huh? See the pipes? This is their contingency plan. There's a riot or an escape, they just open the valve and turn the prison into one big gas chamber. Suki. Should learn from their predecessors. Shh! We'll go as soon as the elevator leaves. Let's move! Sweet mother of God, I heard rumors of a concentration camp here, but to see it with my own eyes. There's a tunnel on the other side. Okay, I lead, you follow. Now keep it quiet, or they'll guess everyone. Let's move! Stay out of the light and stick to the shadows. They are your best friend. Okay, that, 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 that looks like we cleared it. Let's see, let's see. Great. Yeah, mm. Willie, tough luck didn't even budge, huh? All right, we can't go through here, that we know. Okay, where do we go now, huh? What if... Hey, hey, give me a lift, will you? Now listen. Pretend you're a little fucking mouse. What? 
Get down. Don't make any sudden moves. See? Well, let's move. Two fingers Careful, is not closed. You can do nothing but harm, and we will Please. save innocent lives just by shooting you. No, we're not going to shoot you. Thank you, officer. Thank you. Pure say shooting is They deserve nothing more than that. And it's a good show as well. <laughs> Follow me! Fiora is infallible. Of course. The hanging man in these bounds. And we have to clean it down. Okay, it's you take the right one. I the left one. I will distract mine. Then you take yours down. Understand? Please. Get to it. Don't start too soon, huh? Let's do it! <laughs> you won't stand up so much. What's this? We beat you to death with a show. It's a vision. And... Just that? you hey. that. You're lucky. I was afraid you'd squeal. Hey, do you hear me? Look, there's a lever. Get as many of them as you can. We're done anyway. You ain't gonna do squat besides get us all killed. And screw the light bulb. kept pestering me to sell the creature. Said it would be a waste to shoot it, that it paid good money, so I just... Show me the bullets. Sure, sure, look. I'm ready to share. It's too much for me alone. Just don't tell the Oberschaffur. I got 200 bullets out of it. I'll take half. Well, well, why are you walking around? It's just that our shift is in. Then you have no further business here. Off to the barracks with you. Yes, Herr Oberschaffure. We had it bad. Now get us if they hear you. Opa, we made it. <laughs> Молодец, true hero. Now we need to get them to open the airlock from the other side. That button on the wall is the. <laughs> One moment. What kind of joke is this? Come on, quit hiding! Fritz, is that you? Damn it, I'm not gonna open next time! 
It's not even funny. Yeah, let's play the fucking hide. Get in the airlock now. Let us out. Let us out. There's a control panel up there. You can open all the cells. I can't stay here anymore. Please. I want to live. I want to live. Hey, what's going on? Round of fun is just starting, William. Here, catch this. Hmm. Nice watch. Ah, this little blue indicator, it lights up when you're visible, huh? Alright, there's bound to be more guards further ahead, but they won't be able to use gas yet. We can really let ourselves go. Ah, I wish I had a grenade. I'll break through even without one. Let's move here. You take the lower route, I'll take the top, and go. <clears throat> One down. Escape from the Nazi prison could be entitled, The Enemy of My Enemy is My Friend. This friend's name is Pavel. He led a Red Recon team wiped out by the Nazis. I never liked communists much, but Pavel acted like a real hero. Whoa. So, how are you, Chuvak? All right? Oh. You are tough, huh? No wonder they made you a ranger. Follow me, don't stop. Here. Ah. 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 
them. Hold on. There you have it. Ah. On the ground. On the ground, you bitch. Hold on, Artyom, Artyom, hold on, just a little more! Bastards, blend, they're opening the gate! Drop them! I see them! There they are! Piece of... Stop them! Stop! Let's get out of here! We pulled off the impossible. Now I have to inform the Order that the Dark One is missing. Which means to acknowledge that I've failed my mission. But now, when he's down in the metro, I won't be able to find him alone. I have to get to the nearest neutral station and then to Polis. The Order's HQ. Pavel will show me the way. What? Okay, looks like we lost them. Then we'd better hurry to the theater. There's nowhere else to go, huh? Chuvak. Are you alright, Chuvak? That's great. The armor works wonders. Shit! A dead end. Hold on! <laughs> end of the line, huh? Well... There's no helping it. Поехали, we hoof it from here. Follow me. Hmm. No, I don't remember seeing this tunnel on any map. Phew, we're still on right there, though. Be careful. Opa! A pipe! Come here, Artyom! Artyom, get over here! Revolution are not waiting for one man, huh? Come here, Artyom! Let's take him to the guard post! And what if this fuck is not alone? Attention, second guard post. Check your sector at the tunnel. We caught a rat in the vents here. Stay sharp, there might be more. Roger, checking up. Over. This is a fucking mess! A communist rat found in our tunnels! He's not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows? Eh? Eh? Who's there? Who's that? He's right here! Shit, 
Surrender, you hear? I surrender! Let the big wigs duke it out! I've had enough! Pavel's almost certainly going to hang. Who knows? What would have happened to me had he not released me? Red, blue, yellow... What difference does that make? He risked his life for me. You don't get that much in the metro. I can't just walk away on him. I knew it! You're a true comrade. I mean, you're dead for life. Now get me out of here and I'll lead you home in no time. Fuck! Fuck, they're coming for me! Gonna take me to the noose! Good luck, my friend! You're my only hope now! Come on, get
Get your ass out here, you fucking commie rat. Come on, all right? It's true. That either you are a dude or your mother's a whore. You, you. Come on, say my mother is a whore. Say it, you shit. Or else you are a freak. If your mother delivers, freaks. No, no. Spark's gone? Gone, my ass. I told you, man, you shouldn't have sent that crab-handed guy to the camp. He was useful, even if he wasn't. Well, when we beat the shit out of Hansa, we'll have the techies, the whores, and whatever else you want 24-7 and all for free. But in the meantime, we go to the bridge and check out what's smoking there. You could do that yourself just as well. Out again. Uh, if you want something done, better do it. Don't shoot, man. Take anything. But please, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. Picking on one of their own. Bastards. God, do I hate this life. People are worse than beasts. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
We're still on alert! You could at least have your gun at the ready! I've got my gun in my pants. While you left yours at the whorehouse! <laughs> yeah, that gun of yours is going to be so much fucking help when the Reds come for your ass! Shit, the lights out of here! What the hell is up with it today? Can you take a look at it there while I try the switches here? Everything's a-okay here.
I surrender! Surrender! I'll put my weapon down and come out now. Don't shoot! I dragged Pavel out of the noose, and he says he's going to take me as close to police as possible. Then I'll contact the Order and report on everything that has happened. The path to the legendary theater lies through the catacombs. I've never been here before, and without my new friend I'd probably be completely lost. I hope he knows the way. <laughs> That's the way to do it, bro! Just like the three musketeers, eh? if there were two of them. <coughs> you ever read the book? Really confusing, but I fucking loved it. Always wanted to be a toss. Uh, you can be D'Artagnan, huh? 
All right, we're short on time. We go to the attack from here, then you off the police. I head back home to the red line, okay? I don't like how they gave up. The chaser locked the gate behind us. Not a good sign. Shit! and Moscow's right behind us! Forward! Stop! That's why the Nazis cut the light. These things hate it. Okay, Spartan, a short lesson. Bullets won't cut it. But since they are afraid of light, let's take the light to them. In. Ah, looks like they blew the tunnel up. Well, maybe something on the other side they couldn't stop with bullets. Wait, 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 wait. I feel it. Like There's got to be a way through somewhere. Artyom, help me with this. These little ones couldn't make all of this. There must be bigger beasts around. Chuck, be careful not to wake them up. Shit! The blows! Wait, Artyom, don't crash! Careful here. Looks clear to me. Let's go! A shaft! That's high. Definitely no climbing up this one. Okay. Let's hope the elevator works all right. Yes! Generator online. Clear. Monsieur? Let's take this baby for a ride, huh? So, are we going? What the... Why did it stop? Breakers out of wood. Shit. Come on. Blood. They heard us. You may we're right in their fucking nest. Shit. It's a lot of That's the only vulnerable spot! Their top armor's just too tough! Okay, Artyom, if we run into one of these things, put your light on it till it flips belly up, you understand? The bastards hate the light more than anyone. Come on, follow me. Fucking bitch! Artyom! Light! Fry it, bro! There you have it, bitch! Phew. Thanks, Chuak. One for all, huh?
Here! The bridge. Come off, Artyom. I'll try to get us over. Great. This will do. Artyom, Artyom, come help me pull this out. Now don't you turn the light off. Understand we're in a world of hell without it. Ready? Let's go! You all right, Artyom? Come on! Let's go! Light! There! Let's go! How do you like this, huh? How do you like this, bitches? What? Okay, we're safe here. Wait a minute, Artyom, it's, it's bad without the light. Let me make a torch or something. Alright. Light up! Alright, let's go. Close to me! Get lost! Sure! Sure!
looks like there's an electric door. Okay, the wires go. <laughs> oh, over there. Hey, look, there's a light. You got the light. If you follow the wires, it seems like you have two bombs somewhere. You have to follow the gate, but the battery is surely dead now. When you find it, attach your charger to it. Then we'll try to open the door, okay? Now, don't worry about me. I'm a toss. I'll slag them down with my spear. That was cool. Genius. Good thinking. Ready? Okay. First up! Follow me. We're almost at the theater now. The metro entrance should be pretty close. But however small the distance is, we'll have to cover it on the surface. And there, every step you take could well be your last. Chuvak, we're here. Pull yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? Okay, with the tunnel collapsed, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Опа! We're in luck, Артемыч! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably. I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Sure. I don't feel this. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. Hey, Priyatik, I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? You know, I've heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Artyom, remember, if you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? Whoa! That's impressive! I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building where it crashed, that's the entrance to the theater. The ice is towing up here. It's almost like spring, huh, Artyomich? 
Maybe we'll live to see the summer. Wait, 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 wait. There's got to be an underground trap somewhere around here. The rangers would never cross the square off in the open. Okay. We could walk down the wing here. Okay, so much for the sun. Those clouds moved in fast. Let's go out to the light. Check that service room. You okay, Chubak? You're all covered with blood. Artyom, stop! Get down, now! Watchman! You are a huge bag! The storm must be driving them. Ooh. Right. Stay calm, Artyom. If they spot us, we'll be ripped to shreds. That was close. Okay, Artyom, no more tricks like that. Let's get to the plane before another pack comes through. Move it! Oh, I've heard stories about this place. Weird shit happens here. Hey, try opening it. I'll give cover. Yeah, let's try together. Moving. Look, Artyom, don't lose your head in here. You understand me? Okay, let's go. One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. 
family is returning from vacation, you know? You know, Artyom, I've never been to the sea, or even on a plane, myself. Yeah, well, wasn't meant to be. I feel, I don't know, I feel weird. Chuck, are you seeing this shit too? Artyom, what is this? have suffocated like the others did. Ooh, like this one. <laughs> like this one here. Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay, let's get out of this place now. Now! Artyom, go right. I think we'll find the entrance behind the building. Shit, the demon! Take it down, take it down! Fucking watchman, as soon as we moved away from the plane and we were almost there, huh? Get ready! They're moving in from the second floor! Yeah. 
entrance to the theater is around the next corner. We have to move now. Follow me, faster, faster. Come over here. Go. Give me a hand. Faster. More are coming. Bulya, we gotta find the entrance. One more! Shit! Too many of them! We have to warn the station! Get to the escalator! Hurry up! Now! Move down! They're still after us! Our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Man, I wonder if it's such a bad dream today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Well, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. To clear a nest, we need a couple squads at least. So what now? You're not going? Yeah, with the name first. We're waiting for the guy. On the way. Artyomich, so, if it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there above us. All the actors who survived are here. Oh, people come from all over the metro to see the shows they put on. Uh, this happens all the time. But why? Why to us? They keep raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Fiora has the station to himself. But what do we do now? Live! And be glad we won't have our skulls measured every day. Oh, I'm... I'm fainting. Hard to breathe. Calm down. Take a breath. Everything is so, all right. that's our plan. Everything the station calm. next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is fitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through. And you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome. And have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait here forever. Look, I don't make the rules, okay? Who does that? Is it so hard to either accept us or send us on our way? The higher up decide. We send them. Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. So, young men, I see you like my witty sign. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, even peasants, for Christ's sake. All are welcome here. Even lousy actors. 
I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. This station's overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say, the Bolshoi theater, the pride the of Russia, and they the legend are of the metro. Now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are plain fools. They say that art only interests the welfare. But, my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking there are only so many tickets. Dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But, sadly, True art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? Uh -huh. So the rest is still men, not just marionettes. I disgust myself. Here we sit, and drinks, the party lights. When all around us, radiation, death, wow. decay. That is Mind really a really interesting smell you have Is it something new? So, so you know about the theater. Yeah, show something we know. Keep your hands on the shoes. When you get this metal, you know it. That's a demon. So scary, just like the real thing. A demon? Look at it flap its wings. It's attacking. No. Dad says it flaps its wings like this when taking off. And my dad saw lots of demons. We're right, Uncle Misha. This is a demon? Well, it's... All right, let it be a demon. But there used to be birds like this. Birds? Are they mean like demons? No. They were beautiful. Some were big, but smaller than demons. Birds didn't attack people. They would wake you in the morning with their songs. Now, what so Nikitich, when do we become your own father? Have you got enough money to last a week? Buy insurance for your safety. A week? Protect Two days, baby. Then my life is over. These knives, so best for taking stop. care of sentries. Oh, well. Good riddance. At least I had some fun in the end. What? You give up already? Shit. Not to scratch a speck of rust. Of mere Guaranteed to hit. Look, I got money for three days. You already Do have to me. me. Well, the cases ain't new, but these are well made. Well, good luck. You're always welcome here. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. By who? You, you, who a couple of days ago was seen on the revenge at the platform hiding from his wife? <laughs> Don't make us laugh. Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Did you hear that? Oh, sure. Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. Maestro, 
if you'd be so kind. The Gang Cat. I feel sorry for the other performers now. Their attempts at impressing Achoo. the audience might fall no. short Enjoy after such show. a spectacle. Sorry, but man. Time to I move trust on. You they will handle the race far the of our expectations. And thus, our incredible show continues. Oh. This man Pavel spits in the eye of danger, challenges so nature, defies you. the god of the new world, been? and through you once don't again, like us that anymore? humanity is a master. Heaven, no, sto I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sick. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, uh, Let me use your powder. In your dreams, you have your No, he's reliable and doesn't waste his money. In that case, you should just marry him. He won't propose. He's too cheap for that, too. Fool. We're just testing our love. Yeah, yeah. And in the meantime, he made you some powder by scratching the ceiling. At least I have a man of my own, instead of selling myself at the door. They went back to the traditional recipe. They used it yeah. for a gun, but no more refugees. refugees. What's going on? What else? Another war. Let the fucking communists are going to fight the right again. Shit. Is war all they know? Instead of wasting ammo on each other? Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive. Huh? It's on me, okay? The genius of chamber music. The famous accordion player, Kolya Pajarny, with his masterpiece, my heart to Here you are, two of our specials from the old stock, been infusing it for half a year. Opa, that's great! So, let's drink it to him! There you are. Phew, Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but... Yeah, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow, so... <clears throat> yes? Our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ah, where was I? Ah, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. They're freaking eat each other, sell their kids as slaves, it's like the Stone Age. Death to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order, 
is all that matters. That's that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Блин. Кого? Артём, кого? Ботом за. Ботом за. So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Privates, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. It is private. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait. I will get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Hey, stop that, blad! It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now, you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. We, the people of the Red Line, have worked Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General here? What about Comrade Corbin? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Oppa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. Information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooper. Okay. But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us. Comrade General! Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Archer. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the introductory probing and cut to the chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lonya must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Ah! 
Protocols. What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonya. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug! God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers! Just get everything out of him, and shoot the bastard! And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my son! Oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the Dark One? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. And Morozov, and the revolution, and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother. Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here, get in there! This is the way to freedom. Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents. in police? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damn the refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you, and after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This... 
is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the Politburo. Cuz you are one of these days. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground at the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned targets? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway, the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck, then. Surrender! Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbett. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesnitsky bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target.
Who's there? Huh? Hey. Who's there?
about safety
you accept the delivery and sign the manifest? I sure did. Where did you put the goods? Wherever I had space left. Top shelves, mostly. Can you be more specific? Specific? Wherever I left the ladder. There's our goods. My ship... Oh, 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 to stand here much longer.
Stay down, or your brain goes splat. Wait a minute. Artyom, is it you? I was able to send the report back to the Order via my old acquaintance, Andrew the Blacksmith. At least Miller will know that I am alive, that I haven't completed the mission, but haven't resigned from it either. That's one serious pickle you're in. But I can help. I have friends, and they have friends, who can relay everything you tell me to your guys from the Order. So, now you must return home to Polis? Well, there's no direct route. Everything's cordoned off here. But I believe the Order has an outpost nearby. On the surface, the church in the marshes. Try that place. If we can get word to your people, they might meet you there. As for me, I started life anew. Left Kuznetsky most. The Reds completely subverted the place, looking for traitors and spies, sending people to camps, or just shooting them. All because of the coming war. People are fleeing from Kuznetsky most and their whole Red Line. Did you see the armored train the Reds are building? Well, we built something too, with the stuff the refugees are bringing. Here, take a look. At this baby, the boys even gave her a name. You can't help but fall in love with her. She did a swell job running refugees. But hell, you can't save everyone. So, take it. We have people in Venice, too. When you get there, find Woodpecker and tell him where you left our baby. Climb aboard! Come on, climb aboard! Get in, Artyom. You won't break it. All right, start the engine. We're still tinkering with her, so the controls aren't perfect. But the lights are first class. No need to fear the spider bugs around her. And there's a lot of those in the far tunnels. You should go! It's a long way, so you shouldn't waste any time.
Pavel's group is advancing towards Tretikovskaya, also known as Venice. They have a few hours lead on me and are moving via frequently used tunnels. But I will catch up. I can't afford not to. We're armed. We are armed. Swear by Lenin's name. He doesn't look like a GB. I don't recognize the uniform. Could he be one of ours? Look at all his weapons. Don't shoot. We are civilians. There are women and children here. Leave and let leave, okay? We're refugees from the Red Line. I'm in charge here, basically. No, there is nobody under my command. All the battle-worthy men went with the other caravan. Half a click ahead. I thought they'd protect us, but they were attacked. We heard the shooting. It subsided. But it doesn't look like our people survived. So we can't go back. And if we go back, it's the firing spot for us. You look like you've seen your share of fights. Can you help us? It's not for me, but I pity the children. So what do we do now? How do you live without them? They might still be alive. Don't bury them yet. But the shooting... The shooting was so loud. And now there is nothing. And what if they won? Why? Why don't they come for us then? They might come soon. Let's just wait. Do you think they... They killed them all? They could have. Or, it could be worse. How? Women were with them. Yasha, if ignorance is bliss, you're the happiest guy around. So, are we going to help our guys or what? What help can just the two of us be? If they're coming down, we can front the bandits. Let's get ready then. Well, you're not going anywhere. Who is going to protect the women and children? But we can't let the bandits butcher our guys. That stranger is going to help us. Looks like he's worth 20 of you anyway. You are an idiot to believe you're Andre the Blacksmith. Oh, it's safe. You'll get there in no time. And you dragged me here. And now we're all gonna die because of your stupid blacksmith. Shut your mouth. Nobody's coming. Well, perhaps. 
You do it first if you want. I'll stand watch. Okay. Come on, Mama. Come on. Let them in. Get off the floor. I was done for. It took everyone still alive. The kids, the women. I'll move the rail car so that you can drive through. If you follow them, be careful on the technical tunnel. I heard the bandits talk about the trap there. Just rest here for now.
me look. You some shit happened with me now. Okay. your mushrooms now before all the bullets go into your gun. No shit? Well, maybe we should plan this. I know a good place. Hey, the boss team will give you a clash to be a fucking gardener. All right, all right. I won't worry about mushrooms. As long as there are caravans, we can find ours. Bad, zip it. Huh? Who's there?
the world. I was going to do it. Well. What the fuck is up with you? To our duty. The boss said if we let just one slip slip by, he's gonna have our ass. No oh, shit. Let's go. stands up and walks off into the tunnel. And that's fucking it. So, if you ask the guy where it's going, he says, I've been summoned by the master. And once a person is summoned, even if you tie them to their bunks, they'll just pull their ropes up and run off into the tunnel. It's shit to you, it's How about some tea? You're a bastard! No!
surface starts melting. The familiar rail cars are now joined with boats and fishermen. One of them appeared just in the nick of time. Soon we'll be docked at Venice. Pavel is most probably already there. I don't usually fish in this tunnel, but I had a hunch they'd be fighting pretty good here. Careful here. There's more than just fish in that wall. See for yourself, pretty soon. The railing when I warn you. This tunnel leads to Revolution Square in the red line. I saw a boat coming in from there today. Some serious dudes. No refugees. <sighs> Stay quiet now. They don't like noise. And this is their work. See how they just rest there? Easy, easy. We're not here to harm you. Nobody knows what they mutated from. We call them creeps. Ooh, ugly as hell. Eating, especially with me. Come <laughs> on. 
They might turn us over! Doesn't happen often. Looks like we lucked out. The subterranean Venice, an island on the dark waters of underground rivers. You always hear rough stories circulating about this place. I hear it is all one huge den of thieves. But there is something I know for sure. Pavel reached Venice, and if I'm not late, he's still here. Finding the Dark One is still my main mission. But now I see I must also uncover Corbett's plans so that I can warn the Order about them. Wow. <sighs> Seems like we made it. Hey, are you asleep there? What do you think of the local fish, huh? Aren't they charming? Mm, Seem moody, though. Looks like somebody went through there before us and angered them. Open up! The fishermen are back from the seas! Yeah, I see you all right. And who might that be? I picked the guy up in the tunnel. You don't think I should have left him there, do you? What? And make my life easy? Of course not. First of three, no peace with this. And I keep raising a lord of the game. You can bring a girl for once. And what would you do with one if I brought her, Semenovich, huh? You're way too old for that stuff. By the way, you better lower the gate, or else a woman might actually come. The one dressed in black and bearing a sight. <laughs> Never fear. Semyonovich is going to outlive you all. Hey, Fidor, how's fishing? Uh, not even a bite, unless you count the shrimps. And they got a few more out of me than I'd like. I was saved by this land, aren't you? Nice to meet you, Artyom. Thanks for your help. So what exactly did happen? The shrimps were all over us as soon as we got to the fork. Almost took my raft apart. Eh, what the hell gives? Hmm, wonder. Oh, that's easy. The Reds passed through here, going to meet our esteemed neighbors. Didn't seem to care what they stirred up. Ah, so that's why. Look, Artyom, I... Suppose there is no hiding. 
Venice is full of gangsters. Julek, the scum of the earth. So don't you start any shit. I don't want any trouble. Simon! Hey! Simon! I want to talk to you! Look, do you know where might our red guests be? In the brothel, of course. Who's that with you? This is Artyom, the scourge of the shrimps. <laughs> you should see him shoot! <laughs> I never met anyone quite as good as him! A gunslinger, eh? Would you help me take out a few bad guys? Simon, I freaking knew it! This is getting old. But almost all of them are gathered at the storage facility. Look, if this isn't the right time, I don't know what is. Between the two of us, we might be able to take them out. I told you countless times already, and I'm going to tell you again. No! I don't need the shit around here. Do you get me? Yeah, I got you. Right. Then I'm going to leave you two. Okay. In this station of criminals. How is it he's in charge? Hey, Simon. You're good with engines, aren't you? Yeah, what's up? Come on, let me pass! So, I'm just back from a club. Quit making a jam here! I'll Go! Me and the boy. Look, he's got drinks! Young men, I've got a few bullets to spare. How about one more? But there's two of us. So? Oh, what do we have here? Fish bells. Listen, bro. You know, do you have a bullet to spare? I wish we had more visitors like you here. Thank you. Before I buy. Nice catch. So, did you take a look around? I have some business with you. Let's be frank. Seems like you're stuck here for good. Sunken tunnels everywhere. And if you go to Novokuznieskaya, you're as good as dead, probably. Seems like you're out of options. So, here's the deal. You could just stay here with us. You're young, tough, you can handle things, and we'll find you a job in no time. Especially since most of those newcomers here are just human refuse from Novokuznieskaya. Just think about it. You start working with our fishermen, get a bit acquainted with things, then you might actually like it here. We could even find you a nice girl. Well, I won't pressure you. Go get some rest for now, and try to stay out of trouble. The gangsters seem to be jumping. Are always the base for ambushes. They make this real good here. 
You should get some while you can. A unique chance well, to well, come your back anytime. Making money I'll process. always be happy to help you. Real guns for real men. Get I your gun here. Don't you see it's I test it in my I need to get There, on the dock. What the road? What the fuck? Here, I have this. Boatswain sent me. God, fuck you and your boatswain. I'm meat. telling you, it's close. There's, There's a meeting to go. When the boss is stopped talking, you, you can go. And in the meantime, you'll dry away. Hey. Crooks, killers, yeah, bandits. Does anyone need you a gun? Leave. I have just all kinds of guns for sale. See you, man. Get lost. Whatever you want. <laughs> Look, guys, I got nothing. The business is dead here. Business is dead? You're the one who came here, asked us for product. Well, I thought there'd be something, man. Well, there is not. So I'm going to take back our investment. All right, it's okay. All right, hush, baby, hush. What happened? I lost my teddy bear. Hush, baby, it's all right. Find your teddy bear. Don't cry. Where did you walk today? I wanted to show him the shooting range. And then I got yelled at and ran. Best shooting range in the metro. Live targets. Huge bear. The range with was that you sell everything. The rules are simple. You take position and kill all the critters. If you make it before the signal, you can collect your winnings. Incendiaries! Take position, please! Fresh meat nuggets, great prices today. Come with your I bet he's not hitting anything. What's the death? How about two to one? Nice shot. He hits everything. I'm even alright with three. He ain't hitting shit. Alright. It's a deal. Great! Here's your winning. Well, the race. Take position. Myself. Good for shaving. Whoa, that's something. He actually hit. Ah, anyone can get lucky. No for him here. Let him hit the You wouldn't even hit the front side of the front with a stick. Looks like he never yeah. even held a gun. He hit again. Fresh meat was running about just minutes ago. Come get Great! Targets. Here's your winning! How about the race? Anyone looking for Be my guest! I've got them here! Inventory. And here are the sticky grenades! Come on! Get yourself up! Supplies are limited! Come get your nuggets! Hey you! Ah, Why are you gonna do it? Looks like you might be in for three Shut. bottles! No way! He's missing the next one! Hey! What the hell? Hit again? It's getting hit. Really? No dice for him. He ain't my dick. He wouldn't even hit the broadside of a bar with a stick. That was something. Here's a special prize for you. The targets usually last till the evening. Well, our barbecue is going to be busy for a while now. Come get your nuggets. Bullets, knives, explosions for sale My teddy bear! Mom, the teddy bear is back! Where have you been? Were the buttons good? Don't leave me again! Oh, thank you so much! I was at a loss! What should you say? This person helped your teddy bear come home, so what should you say? Thank you. Thank you, you're a godsend. Simon brought that teddy bear from the surface. Toys are scarce here, as you know. So he grew really fond of it. How about we go home now? Can I play here some more? All right, but not for long. We'll go home soon. Come get your nuggets. I have some really kick-ass guns here. Fresh in Bullets, nice grenades, all for sale here. Special menu prices, huge discounts. Freshest meat around. Come on, come on. 
Just don't hurt the girls. Does anyone need a gun? I have all kinds of guns for sale. Come to Papa, Where do I Fresh meat nuggets. <laughs> She's got a slot for those. Hey! What about the money? No fucking reason to stick. Get it from your local boss, bitch. Sure. We don't have bosses here. Cough it up. Are you crazy? They're friends with Kisley. Are you sure? Great. I have to serve all his friends for free and still pay him his cut. I'm sick and tired of this life. What good is it all? I'd be better off on a farm, feeding the pigs. This is so good. You keep dancing, baby. All right, we had some fun. Now it's time for work. So, first thing, we pay Kinsley and you head it to Comrade Corbett. Tell him the virus container's been successfully delivered to Oktyabrska, okay? Hey, pretty boy. Let's Why go. are you just standing up? To hey, why is mom happy? Can't wait to touch me, can you, Daragoy? Well, if you want it that bad... If you decide to come back, I'm always around. Yeah, that's great! The fuck do you want here? Come to Papa Doll. Where do I put them? <laughs> She's got a slot for those. Come get your nuggets. Fresh meat. Come on, shake that ass, baby. Come get your nuggets. I have some really good things here. Fresh inventory. Come on, come on, baby. Nuggets. Great prices today. Come get your nuggets. Hey, baby, I got a pole for you to dance around. Some really kick ass guns here. Fresh inventory. Last time he was here, and Kisley sent it off to Oktyoberskaya. Said he was full of flyers for the working people. Flyers, my ass! That case of the lock! So, what was in there? I wish I knew! Why the fuck do we guard anything? Are we scared of them fucking rangers? <laughs> I wish there was one of them around. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> what the fuck? Where the next fuck <laughs> is? But these damn things are too big. by then hell no sorry man did I interrupt you sorry bro go on yeah so we went to have another and realized we're in a fucking tunnel what the hell fuck if I know one minute we're leaving the bar and somebody stepped on my hand then we're in the tunnel dark as shit <laughs> Drop your weapon, Dylan. Hands behind your head. Well, 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 what an unexpected encounter. Looking for the Dark One? Huh? Well, maybe there's a hope for you and Polis. But then, um, you're too late. Yeah. Those Dark Ones of yours are the real deal, yeah? Comrade Corbett had an eye on them for a long time. Just imagine them domesticated, then unleashed on the enemy. <laughs> Hey, 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 steady, steady, steady now. All right, all right, you're on top, D'Artagnan, you are on top. What now? Uh, you were looking for the dark one, right? Well, he is nearby, at Oktyabrskaya. I can take you there. No tricks this time, you have my word. Everyone on the ground, now! Artyom? No! Shit, he got away. 
did you attack the storage alone? You could have tried to call me. Well, things worked out. But you'll have to get out of here on the double. I know an exit to the surface here. There's a swamp, but it's traversable. Let's go. Put this on. That's for the gangsters. If I'm lucky, our people will be waiting for me at the outpost in the abandoned church. I will tell them everything I know. About Pavel. About a test of some kind they're going to conduct. And will continue my way to Oktobraskaya. The Dark One is there. Here it is, the swamp. The base is right across in the church. You can't see it from here. There's a powered winch ferry. It needs fuel. You should be able to get some in the plane or in the cache at the gas station. Stay out of water if you want to live. Well, that's all. Good luck, Artyom.
I made quite a lot of noise pushing through the marshes. If there really are our people in the church, I will soon meet them. I made quite a lot of noise pushing through the marshes.
Come on in! Come on, get inside. Don't waste your filters. I had you sighted when you were way out there. Almost shot you, too. <laughs> that would teach you to answer radio hails. But I... well... I felt it was you. I hope you'll forgive me for the gardens. For some reason, I was genuinely glad to see Anna, my pain-in-the-ass partner. She finally stopped those wicked jokes of hers. Looks like she's ashamed of having left her partner at the battlefield. I didn't take you seriously before, but Hunter... He read you right from the start. He put his trust in you. It took me time. I didn't understand until I saw you in action, and I almost got you killed. <laughs> you don't make this easy for me, Artyom. I'll stop for now. Go on and get ready. The guys are coming soon and we're all going to Aktiabriskaya. By the way, a traveling gun merchant stopped here for the night, so you could take a look at his merchandise. That's a great idea, girly. Help an old man survive these trouble times. Buy some so, guns. what's going on? Stalker team is on the move. Should be here within the hour. Great. Sanya! What's new in the air? How's the international <laughs> situation? It's incredible. For ten years, nothing but static. Then, last month, I got St. Petersburg. And they know of us. Somebody flew over there with a plane. A little one. Caused a real commotion. Ah, that's old news. What do you hear from New York and London, huh? <laughs> I don't know about London. But there's this city up north. These shells are top class. Made them myself. Some people survived there. I talked to them. A great Our caliber to use against mutants. Them, but they still held Buy the these men. Mutants won't be You're selling any liar, ammo. Sonia. These are select stock. <laughs> perfectly clean and round. These are handmade, but are still good enough. Foot. I'm staying till tomorrow, so if you need anything, come right to me. Where would you put that? Look, you got nowhere to put this. Bye, man.
Have you ever been to the catacombs? Only once. Really old church catacombs. No idea how old they could be. They even survived the nuclear bombs. Some people from the church hid here during the war, but they just... they just disappeared. Could have gone to the main metro tunnels or... Well, people say things, you know? You mean the big mama? Who might that be? Well, our guys are fast. Check it out, just in case. Password! Rock block! That's an old one. I know that voice. Shit, I can't place it. Wait a minute. Could it be Lesnitsky? Anna, what a surprise. I'm no traitor. I never served you in the first place. We'll take this one back. No! That's it. Move!
All the roads lead to Aktabraskaya. The Dark One is there. Anna is there now too. In the hands of my enemies. The hands of the traitor. Lesnitsky. Negotiating with the order. Just make sure she wears a gas mask. If she's infected, she's dead and of no use to us. So, what do we do with her? Log her up and keep an eye on her. Anything happens, it's your head. I'll come get her when we're done here. Save the metro. But... but we're not even feverish. We're... Fire! Can't you hear that thing? You're at the point blank range! Unbelievable! Ah! What does it matter? He's gonna die soon anyway. We're here to make sure he does! Finish him! They came on the second day. No one had died yet, but they came with the flamers. How else could they have known? Go, tell everyone. Tell it. It was the Reds. Get 
What do we have here? Captain Chai. Got hit. While storm the cuts fire. By the wind after the infected. An open wound. Well, the outcome here is obvious. I think you understand what has to be done. <coughs> what? Shit, like a fucking overgrown mud. I'm 
a soldier. I follow orders. You owe me a bullet. Get with your way then, Captain.
Comrade Leslitsky. The operation is progressing as planned. It will be completed within an hour. Well, the experiment has been successful. We need to report that to General Corbett. Will you go? Yes, sir. What's with the broad? Yes, Nitsky broad. Says she's a hostage for negotiations with the Order. Although we all know what sort of negotiations they're having. <laughs>
through that! I'm done. Stand still, or I slit her throat. So. Why? Why did you do that? <coughs> Hurry! <coughs> we have to get caught, Sovaya! <coughs> There's Hansa! <coughs> and our men! <coughs> Suffocating will be <coughs> a real shame after <coughs> surviving all that! <coughs> Pieces of the puzzle are falling together, and the big picture is horrifying and unbelievable. I will tell the others about this, but I still can't make myself believe it. The Reds have infected Oktyabraskaya, a peaceful station denizens of which never suspected anything, with an unknown deadly virus. And then their mop-up squads entered it under the pretense of saving the station from the epidemic and eliminated everyone they could. Women, children, old people. To prevent the infection from spreading. And if all this is true, then me and Anna could be infected too. We've been saved from being killed, but we don't know if we're going to survive for long. I have a feeling that everything will end soon. We won't survive this war, Artyom. No one will. I feel alone again. Like when I was a girl and father was away on a mission. Nothing around me. Empty and cold. As if I were just a spark from the fire flying away and then gone. It's hard for me to tell you these things, Artyom. But I want to feel that I'm... alive. Touch me. Well, there seems to be nothing wrong with you. Congratulations, youngsters. You, Archeum, may go. While you, Anna, you have to stay some more. We need to finish treating your wound. Oh, thank God. Well, what are you waiting for? Go! Go, Artyom. I'll find you as soon as they finish patching me up. Come here, darling. Don't look there. What's that, Papa? Nothing. It's all right. Who's there? Just don't you see the face. As if looks like eighth box. <laughs> yes, it's eight. Simetsky, Yuri. Oh. 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 Hey. So, what do I do now? Hey. What do I do, doctor? Somebody. Well, you know the prospects as well as I. You can't go into the board. I know. Go through the lab. I know, but still. Hush. You were instructed on the safety precautions. On the gloves, on the mask. You signed the papers. You're not going to get away with it. Yes, I, I did. I'm completely gone. So, I don't have to remind you about the gloves, the mask. They were scared. They were yes, crying. I know that. Perfect. Now, you take the temperature every hour. Blood samples every three been hours. Told to handle their stuff. Call me at once. Look at all this. Any parameters? TV. Well, what is there to do? They got off easy, but we got to pack all that. Yeah. And what's the point? Huh? Should just burn it with the corpses and be done with it. 
They say it's to find the source of infection. Bullshit, if you ask me. No way to do that now. Well, those at the top know better. The guard room is that way. He's not safe here. Please go. So, were you able to isolate the agent? Yes and no. It is. You can't go in there. It's a high danger zone. But trying to cultivate it is useless. It's basically non virulent now. Without the original strain. Doctor, you know I'm no medic. Please explain. Uh, I'm sorry, girl. Here are the facts. In the first two days, the mortality rate was around 95%. In the third, it dropped to about 25%. Today, we only have two new infected, and they have a light infection, prospects of recovery looking promising. Now, as you understand, Moscow never was a natural habitat for this virus, and in its wild form, it remains dangerous much longer. So, what does all this mean? It is not a regular virus. It's a weapons-grade strain, engineered to achieve maximum lethality within a short time, and then turn harmless. Damnation. Where did it come from? I have heard of a new generation of bioweapons based on this virus, being developed before the war. But where did it surface from now, after all these years? Bioweapons. My god. Just in case, I have some Rangers questions. One of them could have brought this surprise from the past to the Metro. Yesterday. Yesterday. 
I almost survived. Sorry, that's forbidden without a permit. That's our man. Let this one through. He got a permit. I think you should stock up on filters and ammo, Artyom. We won't have such a chance anytime soon after this. Well, we sure got lucky the Rangers from here. Why did they fight anyway? What do they care for us or the refugees? That's what puzzles me. Where's the profit? Nobody signed any contracts with them. We didn't even promise anything. What were they thinking? Hey, Ranger! Have us some ammo! Buy these? Nobody will give you a better price. Come here, Ranger! Let's haggle! I'd be happy to sell, but we can't carry anymore. Nah, hey, some throwing that. It's cheap. a job. The Polish Rangers were doing stuff like this from the very beginning. Grenades at a great price! I got some incendiaries. Best cure for competition. I have some mines too at a special price. Come, come, take a look, Ranger. I have everything. Good luck with business, Ranger. Come here, Ranger. I got great weapons. Artyom, take note of the funds Hanser expends on this quarantine. They are generally quite reserved with their money. Perhaps they are aiming for an additional trump card to use in negotiations at Polis. Good luck in the tunnels, Ranger! In some other time and place, what happened could be life-changing. But there is no time but present, and no place but the metro for us. And we must do everything we can to save it. I have to hurry and catch up with the Dark One. Anna has to tell her father of what Korbut and Moskvin are doing. Anything else is a luxury we can't afford right now. We've got outgoing! Open up! Soon, the leaders of Hansa, Redline and Reich will meet in Polis, hoping to reach a peaceful settlement on D6. <sighs> but I know the nature of man all too well, Artyom. War is as certain as the fall of night, unless a miracle happens. Come through! Well, we won't catch the train with the Dark One moving along the tunnel. But there is another way. We're leaving the station. Here's our pass. All right. Are you going to Polis? No. Open the Interline Tunnel for me. Shit just keeps breaking up. But the Interline is a dead end. And very dangerous. A dead end? No way. That's our road to Polis. Open up. Let's go, Artyom. Careful with the generators! As you see, it's no dead end. That's just what the Hanser authorities claim to discourage people from entering these passages. An unprepared man could easily lose his way here or even become lost within himself. But as long as you're with me, there is no danger. Most people believe Metro to be just tunnels and stations, a lifeless and soulless conglomerate created by human hands alone. 
there's a special place in Demetrio. The few people who come upon it never return. I call it the River of Fate, because it can change your destiny, wash away the silt of the past, and offer the chance for a different future. this river in dire need of such a chance, wishing desperately to earn it, then he might be carried to the place and time where that chance is granted. Remember, we must find the Dark One. It is the only thing we are to ask of the river. The Metro is a living, breathing thing, with a heartbeat a soul, and a mind. It's an abandoned place. and monsters, nothing else. Let's go.
Alright. There's something behind these cobwebs. Intriguing. Is that a sign? The grate is rusted and poorly attached. Give me a hand here, Artyom. One, two... Ah. Continue burning it, Artyom. Look, water. We're almost there. Pretty close. not get lost in it. Do not rush now, and don't be surprised by anything. It is a strange place. You can pick it up. I think it's for you. Familiar scenery? It's the tower. And down there is the city of the Dark Ones. It's the dream of the approach to this lesson. The river will cleanse you, forgive your sins. You can change your fate. You can do it. Choose your destiny and be free. Fast! 
Panther. Nobody. A dead end. Is this where you almost caught him? You must try again, Artyo. The Dark One. He's still at that freak show. On the train. Look! After him! Run! Ahead! The river almost got me this time. Oh, it's working. We're back in the desert of the real. When we got out of the river, the dark one was very close. He can't have gotten too far ahead. But the train's got to be nearby. Post 13! Post 13, come in! High alert! I repeat! High alert! Red saboteur sighting confirmed! Your position might be attacked! The evac train is come considered on, primary target! High alert! We need that miracle now, Artyom! Remember everything I told you about the Dark One! You must save him! And then he just might save us all! I never believed him. And that is no surprise. But Khan's words were true. This strange river took me to the past. The moment where I sent out the signal and destroyed all the Dark Ones. And then it dropped me off at the place where I can find the last survivor of that race. A helpless and harmless child. Khan called him the last angel. The train's somewhere around here! I have this feeling!
So big now. Mom, I'm scared. Don't be afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of now. Don't leave, Mom. I'm all alone now. You're not alone. You're the first. We remembered you and were waiting. We could remember all the thoughts of our race. And you killed everyone. And now I'm alone. I could not kill him. And while I am alive and my heart is beating, I will protect him. Khan says we will be able to use him to stop the war. Yes, he can make miracles happen, but I don't want to use him. His war was over when I targeted the missiles at his home. His family.
You and the other people are strong. You can kill anyone. I will come with you. A thing you know. I need it. Do not understand yet. Something important. Many hungry ones here think you're food. You all wear clothes. I want to, like you.
them like you, with clothes. Whatever my intentions concerning him might be, the little dark one just does not seem to care. He keeps following me, as if I never was going after him. As if we were tied together by fate. Time we go. You do not see them? You cannot see? Red. Dangerous.
many of them.
very fast, but I am working. Sometimes I see a door. Somebody calls for you from there. Why? We are coming to police, together, come what may. The little one did not want to leave, something is holding him. I don't yet get what. Nevertheless, I'm glad it is, because he is helpful. Stand up. He's a police ranger. Going down to ring? Well, hurry up then. They're all jumpy. Didn't even want to let us through. Come here. Let me exchange some ammo for you. Look, buy anything you want. All the ammo is the best quality. I shoot it myself, but a man's gotta eat. This you can find only here. This is your chance. Come on, buy some. These are the best. Look here. Just tell me what you want. I've got it all. Come here, Ranger. You do understand I'm not unpacking all of my stuff. Just the best. Well, we're still here. Talk to me if you need anything. Come on, don't be shy. People ahead, waiting for us, eager to kill. Don't know where you need. Men hold and fire hold. Learn every inch of this place, like the back of your hand. Yes, come with the Move out then. Nothing here either. Clear. Where 
going to find the fuck. Let's move out and find the fuck. Hey, you! Bitch! Shut up! <laughs> So you have these. Good? Now I know what for. I'll bring more. I heal. I help. Not always enough strength alone. Kulagin, stay speaking and follow the path. We might still catch up with the caravan. Klimitsky, stay here. Yes, go round, Lieutenant. Yes, sir!
the hell are you doing out in the open? Hide your ass now! Yes, sir! Do I have to guide you ladies by the fucking hand? Tell me your orders! We're to infiltrate the depot and wait for a rain. All of us. A beat to Very a red. Then we kill the Very red. Very eager to kill. But where is your step? Huh? You think the ranger's gonna give you a hug when he sees you? That the beast will roll over for Tommy Rock? No, sir! Screw up again and you'll be cleaning my boots the same way you kiss your mother. He said, fuck you. You got that beast now? Sir, yes, sir! I have a bad fear. It's not like we're looking for your regular s. Gotta watch our asses. So what if he's a ranger? We're pretty tough ourselves, eh? He's not just any ranger. On the Hansa train near surface, he wiped out an entire squad. How would you know? You weren't that surface. A couple of wounded made it out. They called him an animal. The, the, the creature was more human. We'd better be careful then. Shut the hell up and focus! Roger that.
Them again. Black and red. They fear and still want to kill you.
Mikhail Snitsky. Everything all right here? Of course. Nothing ever happens in D6. Makes you wonder why we have to stand guard. Looks like something important. All right, position taken. Perfect, Lesnitsky. Now it is your turn, Comrade Morozov. We must field test this virus that we have obtained at such risk. I think you had some uh, associates suitable for the task? Yes, Cheslav Andreevich, out of Venice. His bandits think I'm one of them, and if we pay them... Spare me the details. I just need results. Is your task clear, Comrade Lesnitsky? Yes, Comrade General. Did you think we'd just let you go? We'll see about that. I have a trump card. You. See to it then. Then you will have to handle Red Square, Pavo. It's the most critical part, and there's no one else I can trust with it. Do not let me down. I won't, Comrade General. Interesting. But I'm too tired. Need to stop. He is very bad. But you're right. Killing is worse. He who sows the wind shall reap the storm. The Dark One opened up Lesnitsky's thoughts to me. I know all their plans. I know Pavel is going to be at the Red Square. And that's where I have to face him. Before going to Polis. A peace conference is being held there. Laughable. The war has already started. It won't stop while there's a person alive in Metro. All trying to stop it could just as well try and stop a tornado with their bare hands. But I still have to try. I have to reach Polis to denounce the liars. And face the storm. Shadows here. Many. Don't see me. Don't hear. Alive and dead at once. Very strange. Here, it will help you breathe. I'll stay close.
A little human is looking for another human. Not like you. A woman? Yes. A woman. Mother. Found this. But try not to kill him. I'll not be far. Thank <laughs> you. 
piece of life. You'll need this. I will be back soon.
does not understand that he's dead. He's still waiting for his mother. But she is not coming. Mine neither. Because you people killed them all. I know only one way into police from here, through the Red Square. The Order keeps an outpost in the St. Basil's Cathedral. I'll get in touch with our men and tell them all I know. And my goal would be just a step away from there. It will all be over soon. There's danger here, not like before. I feel it. And we'll be with you. We'll tell you what to do. Makes it easier to understand. Is this the center? All the roads lead to this place. That's why they could not leave. They are here, for too long. So many of them. And they know. They know we feel.
Jesus. Don't stand. I will help. Do not disturb them, Martin. Stay close to me. They've been here for so long. Lots of them. But they are all lonely. Only fear and pain. They can't leave. And want somebody to stay with them. One more. Put your weapon on the ground and hands behind your head. I will be doing this, Artyom. Well, you're not have to run out someday. You can disregard the order by the weapon, okay? Comrade, we have special orders directly from Comrade Corbett concerning this very ranger. We are to eliminate him. Fire! Fire at will! Don't stand. I will help. No more. I'm tired. Stand down! Attack! Eliminate him! Carry out the order, Blin! It will help you see. And you had a chance. You know you could have stayed at the red line. We would have taken you in. Pepper! 
So you just head to escape, huh? And then come right here. You lose your fucking head sometimes, that's you. Or what? Maybe you thought Corbus forgot all about you? Not on your lifetime, D'Artagnan. And neither did I. You'll just have to buy the fucking dust here. Well, I'm sure this is getting serious. So, guys, soldiers, finish him! Attack! Let's avenge our comrades! You decided to show up? <laughs> you got balls, eh? That's for sure. Come on, Ranger. Kill a name like you always do it, huh? Or you're a chicken? You're chicken or what? Bop, 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 bop. So, Artemka. You chicken. You are one tough son of a bitch. Come on, Artyom! Come on! <coughs> Come up here, bitch! I can't chase you anymore, but I can still put a hole through your head if I see it. It isn't rain. No anger. Just... sadness? I don't understand. The test at Oktyabriskaya was successful. The virus kills fast and goes inert fast. If we can get enough of it, clearing out the whole metro is possible. But we must capture D6 first. Thus, Comrade Morozov, you have only one chance to pull this off. The Order has good fighters, but there are too few of them to cover all the entry points. Our scouts have located a poorly defended entrance through Kremlin. While Miller's at the peace conference in Polis, he will be unable to command his men. That's when we strike. Yes, a week longer, and then comes the dawn of a new age. Artyom! 
So that's what forgiveness is. Thank you. I will remember this. to make it to Polis in time for the peace conference. There isn't going to be any peace. Just war. The last war. Now I know the answers to all the questions. Pavel's head proved to be a real treasury of Corbett's sinister plans.
She's protecting her children. Watch out! You're in one piece. And you've brought a friend. Wait. Is this? Artyom, this kid shouldn't be out there without a gas mask. What the fuck? Ah, so it is, so it is. A child of the surface. A dark one. No! Don't shoot him, Miller. Then get it away from me. No mask. I should have known. This one's green, but that one's yellow. Tell him I'm not a danger. It seems he is adapting well. Yes, that will keep him alive. May I talk to him, Artyom? Come on, Miller. Put your fear aside. This child is the future. You need only take its hand. My hands are full enough. I doubt this creature can help us. But you too. You go on without me, before I give in to better judgment and rid the Earth of it. Is this? Oh, oh, I, I can understand his thoughts, and I can hear yours, Artyom. Can you hear anyone's thought just by touching them? With Artyom, it's different. We can talk from afar. He was adopted long ago. But do you see, Artyom? The Dark Ones changed you so that they could understand us. What's behind that door? Did you hear? They call you. I can hear. Open this. Wait. That looks like one of the sealed doors in D6. Yes, at the exhibition. It has a strong lock, too. We've yet to break it. What's there? My people? They're inside. 
sleeping. Incredible! Look at this! They're hibernating! He is not alone! I must wake them up. It's time for them to leave. We are all going there now. We'll open the door if we can. There's... death. Nearby. All around. But I must wake them. Or be alone forever. Now listen. Help us, and we'll help you. I will. What needs to be done? I must wake them. We'll have to improvise. Hey, hey! Wake, wake up, up, you bastards! bastards. Colonel, can you open the gate where the garden's line ends at D6? Do you have the code? I have all the codes for D6, but I can't promise a thing. You'll have to. He will help us in police if you do. Take him along then, and brief me on the way. If I'm convinced that he'll help us, I'll open your door. Follow me! He is not alone. He's not the last. I understand his excitement and his wish to immediately meet the others, to free them and wake them up. But he has agreed to wait a bit longer. First he's going to try and help us. If we make it to the conference, the Dark One will be able to open up the thoughts of Moskvin, or Corbut himself. Perhaps make them stop this madness. This is our last chance. Artyom, we already knew of Oktobriska from Khan. And we did confront Moskvin on this. Yet he didn't even try to disprove Open it. Gate. He told that by sheer luck, yes, their chemical defense squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifice, they were able to nip this starting epidemic in its blood. Otherwise, it would have engulfed the whole of me. What can you say to that? Even I would have done the Subject same. But come on, it was Lasnitsky, yes, the agent sir. who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So what? There is not a single living witness besides Artyom. Who'd believe the order? We have the D6 now. What if it was us who released the virus? But the Reds tried to break through into Hans's territory. We could make Moskvin. What can we do? We are not an army. Engage We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, sir. yes, Moskvin did gear up for war. But after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside D6, he might actually agree to oh, peace. Please. And we must do everything to have that agreement signed. Moskvin? What difference does he make? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are encircling you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood! Oh, what? Yes, You've got sir. a better idea? You brought this ape here! Open what airlock. now? Yes, We're sir. done with this. Let's go to the Council Hall. Follow me! Permission to report, Colonel. Denied. Urgent dispatch to D6 Security Force Commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Well, he knows what to do. Please let this work out. to the little one. Hurrah, comrades! Let there be peace in the name of our children! You are a liar! Come, are you out of your mind? I know what I'm doing. Just believe in me. Just this one time. Who are you? Guards, take this man away. Ranger, stand down! Artyom, little one, 
It's your turn! Comrade Moscovin, you must support me on this. Or else, some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. I overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. What the hell? Threat? We're brothers! He thinks you feel bypassed, cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. Maxim, brother. I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. What? It is your Silent treatment. What are you looking at me with those honest eyes for? It was your fault. Who wanted me dead? Corbett sold you out. And now, he's got me by the balls. All because of you! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, brother. There's no forgiveness for me. Even so... What... What was I... I... Out loud? Ah, I see. So you gave me something. Just like I gave something to brother. Yes. Yes. I did. I poisoned him. But Corbett. I'm a fool. I thought he wanted to save me. And he just took the power. Took me by the throat. And he's storming the D6 now. And there's that virus! And if that falls into Corbett's hands, the end! You but you are the leader! Order him! Boo. Call the troops back! You stole them at least! Buy some time to make a deal! What kind of... There's nothing more we can do here. Spoilers. Hurry! Faster! To the platform! Damn them! I'm not surrendering D6! Follow me! Will be bad for everyone if you lose? Then I have.
have to save them. My family. You're good, Artyom. He is gone. He did what he could. And now he is gone to meet his kin. I can't judge him for that. The remainders of humanity are finishing each other off in their final fight. It is not his war. I hope he was able to forgive us. Me. For what we did to his brothers and sisters. His mother and father. Moskvin wasn't bullshitting this time. The Red Line's advancing on three sides. My brothers in arms. I am not a man for speeches, but here it is. You are the most dedicated, most courageous soldiers in the Metro. Each of you is worth five reds. If you simply do the job you were trained to do, we'll win this battle. Sparta! To battle! Trust Sparta! Ready, people.
They're falling back! We won! We beat them! We really did! You don't fuck with Rangers! Don't get too cocky! They're still strong! Report the situation, Sergeant. Colonel! Wounded are out of the fire zone and headed to the evac point! Well done! Regroup and get ready! They're going to go at it again any moment now! Yes, sir! for demolition. I gave the order back in Polis. Now that we have lost D6, our only option is to destroy it. What the hell is this? Waste of men and resources. So many good soldiers lost. And for what? Police station? The council? Ah, well. All are cleansed by the fires of revolution. What a pleasant surprise, Colonel Miller. Or what remains of you? Artyom, it is time. And who may this be? Ah, the resourceful young man. Tell me, Arthur, savior of the metro. Where are you going? Stop him! The 
Don't be afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of now. Papa defeated our enemies and saved the metro. Was my Papa brave? The bravest of us all, because he was never afraid to embrace the things he didn't understand. And where did the Dark Ones go, Mama? Away, to a safe place. But they promised to come back.